for Dallas. Ball at the 11. This is Felix Jones, the rookie, pounding it in for a touchdown. Touchdown Dallas, and it's Felix Jones getting it after a marvelous career in Arkansas, and he makes good on his opportunity here in the third quarter. And a player that the Dallas Cowboys got with a first-round pick they picked up from Cleveland the year prior when Cleveland wanted Brady Quinn. Pounds it in here against the Browns. 28-7 Dallas. We'll lunch with Jerry Jones, the Cowboys owner. Uh, their thoughts as well with all the folks down Dallas and Houston way. Felix Jones, the return. Felix Jones passed in the Lakers. Felix Jones being chased down by Dents. Touchdown. for the rookie from Arkansas. And you'll see Felix Jones explode through that lane right there, and no one's going to get Felix Jones. Well, I had a chance to watch him last week against Cleveland, and you can see the acceleration when he sees a gap. Felix Jones, great vision and explosion. Players, but I thought he was a better receiver. In this NFL game, you've got to be able to catch the football, and Felix Jones can do that. I believe you'll see more things like this, not just a kickoff return. If you're a Cowboy fan, you'll love to see a lot of those. They use him coming out of the backfield as a receiver. Let me ask you a question. Yeah. What more do you want out of this game? So <laughs> Cowboys defense holds him to just three points, 6-3, when it's Felix Jones off to the races with some help from much to block he gets that block shield the next guy getting away touchdown good hustle 60 yards felix jones the first player in cowboys history to have a touchdown in each of his first three career games a lot is the running back to the right side they're going to run for it with the rookie and he's got the edge felix jones taking off for the touchdown Right tackle Mark Colombo completely sealed the right side and to go untouched. Yeah, the good job by Colombo getting outside. Tremendous mistake by the Bengals defense. Somebody's got to contain. You make him cut it back, he gets the first down, but it's posting a field goal and now a touchdown. 10 0. Close, very close. So Barber does all the heavy lifting, that 35-yard run, and then Jones pays it off, and the Cowboys check out. take the lead with the extra point. Sorry, I'll check out Kozar coming into the hole and just absolutely wiping out Danny Clark. Great blocks inside. The left guard pulls around, and look at that block. Oh, my goodness. 340 left in regulation, 31-30, Cowboys. Couple of guys running across throw. the field. In the oh, next man. play, the owner said, get this man the ball, so they did. And Felix Jones runs 46 yards to Pager, 10 nothing for Wade Phillips and the Dallas Cowboys. He, he might be their most explosive player. I know we've seen Miles do it, but when you put them against the Saints in that great passing game, same kind of pressure. And then two plays later, here's Felix Jones running downhill. Look at the blocking downfield. Doing what he can do. 49 yard run, Cowboys. And in round spot first and 10 from the 40 to the 27 yard line. Jones. Jones off to the races. Jones cuts inside of Hanson. Samuel has an angle on him, but he runs away from Asante for a touchdown. 73 yards.
longest run in Cowboys postseason history. Big smile from Wade Phillips for a guy who they describe in Dallas with one word, explosive. Down, down, pull Leonard Davis out. Look at the secondary. Nobody in behind. They're playing man coverage as they try to blitz. And when you pop one against that, look out. That Felix Jones is something in the open field. Power is going to get brought back up. It's provided the phones work. It's third and ten. Kitna drops it off. That's Felix Jones. Room to run. On third and ten, Felix Jones may take it all the way. Felix Jones will coast for the touchdown. In a game of big plays for the Dallas Cowboys, they just get another 71 yards to the light and to the end zone for well, Dallas. The Giants are in man coverage. It looks like right here. Now that's tuck. I couldn't tell who exactly was supposed to be in man coverage on Felix Jones because they're man elsewhere. And then once Felix Jones gets the ball to the outside, everybody running with their backs to Felix Jones and with a convoy out in front of them. And once you're going to see that they're in man coverage here running off. The problem is, is there nobody in the middle that's going to account for Felix Jones. Just a blown coverage there as to who it was that was assigned. To Second day. Make sure he crosses the plane before we do anything else. Certainly looks like it. Hard to tell where the knee is. Remember, they're calling it a touchdown. With the forearm strike, there was his arm down underneath, right there. Mistakes tonight, big mistakes. Really the difference. Now they put Phillips in at fullback. On a toss with Jones, he's in there. So the Cowboys who almost had that touchdown on the Lee play. And one rule change this year we should point out in the old days, that would have been a challengeable play, but they've taken that away. All scoring plays are reviewed. It's first and goal, and they score on second down and goal. Watch the reach here by the new rookie, Bill Nagy. That's a tough block. Got all the way to the outside, was able to do it by himself. Led to the walk in. 12 carries, 34. Dallas into the end zone. Up by 14. Success in the red zone. He doesn't care what his overall ranking is, but he knows red zone success is a major determinant for success. Felix Jones, he'll gobble up all that yards. And he is run out of bounds at the one. And after watching Kansas City just run right down the collective throat of this defense, Dallas is doing the same on the ground today. I want you to watch this edge again. This is twice now they've gotten to that edge. Ray Lewis not being able to get off the block to close off a play that normally he would. Tries to drop his shoulder. You've got to stick the ball out there, son. Oh, boy, this one's going to be looked at. Someone's going to throw a flag here because that looked like a touchdown. Of course, it was a non-scoring play, so this is not going to come above from above. And now Jason Garrett gets the red flag out there. Shows off that right arm. Yes, he does. Five years in the league as a quarterback. Got that thing darn near out to the half. Garrett is the first former Cowboys player to become the team's head coach. This looks like a touchdown all the way. I got a feeling we're coming down to a verdict that says touchdown. The ruling on the field is the ball is short of the touchdown. This looks like a touchdown here. He is in bounds. Now he's going to reach the ball out over and break the plane right there over the pylon or inside the pylon, I should say. Well, that's a touchdown, folks. Doesn't matter where the back lands as long as the ball crosses the plane in the play of field inside the pylon. 
Should be noted that Jason Garrett is one and one. One four one in challenges. Trying to make it two out of two right now. After review, the runner remained inbound for a score. So it is a touchdown for the Cowboys. For what it's worth. All time in a short time where you're able to challenge a play. No team has successfully. Felix Jones will find the end zone. Linebackers and everybody running out. You're gonna see Stevie Brown here and the impact that this play action has on him. You know, he's out of the way, and then you hesitate those linebackers just down the field so they can get the ball into the end zone for a completion of the touchdown. Jones out of the backfield. Smith misses a block. Eagles miss a couple of tackles. Touchdown! Tear it for more missed tackles by this defensive group, and there's Asimo right in the middle of that problem again. There's there's three or four missed tackles right there. Nate Allen has the first shot at it. Asimo has to make that play, and he's coming off a game to where he did not tackle Garrett because they're taking advantage of it. They're calling the right patterns underneath stuff. He looks Jones right side. He broke the ball. touchdown. A little pushing and shoving at the goal line. Well, again, it's been mainly through the air, and where they had to stuff it in, Lawrence Vickers, the fullback, was out in front getting a pretty good block. Terrific yeah. second effort by Felix Jones. Yes. John Phillips, the backup tight end, got his job done. So I don't care who you talk to, even Robert Griffin the thirds. Idols, John Elway, Dan Marino, or whoever. I mean, if you make them throw the ball every down without any type of running game at all, it's it's hard to win games. It's third down and seven underneath. It's Jones, and he just wanted it. Touchdown! Great effort, Felix Jones, who had two guys to run through, and he did it for a 10-yard touchdown. See right here, Perry Riley, that opens up that area for Felix Jones. He's got his back to the ball. He's not able to come converge on Felix Jones. London Fletcher playing deep, just trying not to give anything down the field. But not until Felix Jones gets it across the goal line for the touchdown. Looked like the ball was starting. It did come out, but Felix Jones obviously lands on it for the touchdown. They're going to go for two here. The Cowboys are.